Welcome to the Talking Diaries podcast featuring Dr. Louis Coster with John Kramer. Are you ready? Yeah. So, where the where the heck do problems come from? <laughs> Because I, because because I see them all around me all the time. But but I, where do they come from? Yeah, I. That's a great question. So so, I like to rephrase that question. Like <laughs> what are <laughs> what are problems a function of? So the short answer is that problems are when we take ourselves too seriously, <laughs> too seriously. <laughs> that is, that is um, an effect when we take our thoughts too seriously. So, so often what we call problems are not really problems. Like a real problem would be if you don't have any food and you're not able to eat, like there's no food or you don't have a shelter and, and, and you're looking for shelter. That is a real problem. So, so often what we call problems are not real problems, like not real problems as in that you're looking for food or you're looking for shelter. So you could say, so that, 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 like most likely, uh, problems are when you are not in touch with your true nature, when you are not, when you, when you live a world that is the illusion of the thinking, when you, when you identify yourself with the self that that in fact does not exist uh, because then you get problems like for instance or what we call a problem does this person like me or i saw this expression on that person's face what does that mean will it have an impact on my job or there's something like that so right. These are not real problems. No, there's an experience of a problem that does not mean that the problem is, is pertinent to your life. So to make the, the distinction, I think is very, well, it's called interesting, but also helpful since in the recognition that, that, that some of the stuff that occurs for us that occurs as a problem might not be a real problem. And it is in the discovery of what is true and real that you get to see what is really relevant and what is the right action to take. But yet if you say that the unreal problems uh, come about because of, because you're not real. The self is not real. Why, why are the problems you call real, such as shelter and uh, food, why do they matter if the self is not real? Okay, well, um, these problems matter because because your life is at stake because because you 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 um, uh, that is a pertinent concern so and what is also very interesting is that when you're faced with a real problem like that there is not a lot of thinking and and it might not even be perceived as a problem it's just something that you are in action about Okay.
Thank you for listening to the Talking Diaries podcast featuring Dr. Louis Coster. For more information, check out louiscoster.com forward slash Talking Diaries and subscribe to the Talking Diaries YouTube channel. Also check out louiscoster.com forward slash quiz and take the free quiz to discover more about yourself.